Strange things are happening in football and in baseball. They always have and they always will. Let's remember a few recently and from years ago this week in sports history. Hi, everybody. This is Short Shots. The fourth biggest comeback in college football history took place two weeks ago. Stanford trailed Colorado 29 nothing and a half before coming all the way back to win in double OT 48-45. Also, Miami just had to take a knee with 12 seconds left to win, but they did not. A fumbled handoff, change of possession stopped the clock, a long Hail Mary touchdown resulted in Miami's first loss of the season after a 5-0 start. These losses are hard to get over. I still have scars from the push-push and the Red Sox four straight wins at after they were down 0-3 to the Yankees in the 2004 ALCS. Then there was the miracle in the Meadowlands and the craziest, zaniest finish of all. A California back ran through the Stanford band and into the end zone to score 30 seconds after time ran out. We could talk about crazy game endings for a half hour or more. Plays that happen because of the way the ball bounces, human error, and mental mistakes. They're still playing baseball and were at this week in 2005. Let's go back to game two in the ALCS between the White Sox and the Angels in the bottom of the ninth with two out and nobody on base. A.J. Brzezinski swung and missed a low pitch. The Angel caster thought that he caught the ball cleanly or he thought the umpire didn't notice and he rolled the ball toward the mound ahead for the dugout. However, the home plate hump ruled the ball, hit the dirt before the catcher caught it and it was therefore a drop third strike. After taking a few steps toward his dugout with the Angels leaving the field, Brzezinski dashed toward first and arrived safely. Inning on over, the Angels get back to their positions before Joe Creed hits one into the gap that sends the runner all the way home for the White Sox victory. But around this area, how many viewers were really watching? Not too many. But this year, it could be very different. Chances are the Phillies could win the World Series, Penn State could win the NCAA championship, and the Eagles could win the Super Bowl. Take it to the bank. I think at least two of those three will happen. Mark it down, mother of God. Thanks for watching. Till next time, be a good sport. Stay loose.